Hey everybody, a really quick video. I've got this K-On rear antenna mount and the antenna on there. And um, I think, did these come with this? I'm not sure, but it's just feedback on how well they stick. Now I would have cleaned this properly to make sure they stick, but I just want to show you like how they're, they're not only are they stuck, but look, I'm pulling on them to get them to come off. Really hard to get it to break, right? So they are really good. Just wanted to show you these things. They're bloody good. Quite look, you can see. Can you see how much pressure I'm putting on there? To... So they don't just come off on their own. If they come off, you haven't cleaned properly. Just want to provide some feedback. That's really good. There's a whole reason why this antenna is coming off. There's going to be a more detailed videos on both of our YouTube channels. So subscribe, turn the bell on, and we'll catch you on those videos. They'll be a bit longer than this one. Catch you on the next one. See ya. Hey everyone. Yes, this vehicle's been off road. I've got the rear trim off, and I just wanted to show you how it's all clean. And look, there's no dust in there. Why is there no dust in there? Oh my goodness, no Let's dust. Let's take a look in here. Surely there's got to be some dust in here where the jack is. Let's get the light on. Always works better with a light. Why is that jack so clean? Ah, this thing must be like a brand new car. Well, no, it's not, people. It's done uh, 76,000 Ks almost. And the reason there's no dust in there and in the rear door is because, like I've said in videos, and you might have missed it if you don't watch all the videos till the end, but like I've said, leave it on fresh on dirt roads to maintain cabin pressure. When it's on fresh, what that means is the air will get pulled in there to the fresh air system climate control into the Take vehicle. Take a look at our tow bar installation video when we've got this rear bar off installing this home and race tow bar without all the stuff hanging down underneath. It's the good option really. But um, if you saw that video, go and have a look at it. Just put tow, right tow bar, search our channel, tow bar installation. And when you see that, you'll see the air vents. I'm sure I would have shown where the air comes out. So it's in the front, out the back. So that maintains cabin pressure. Have your fan speed up a little bit. The, the more dust and the faster you're traveling, give it at least three on the fan speed. Give it a moderate amount or give it a lot. And if your cabin filter's blocked, it also won't bring air in. You didn't think of that either, did you? So if it's blocked up, it can't bring air in. So you need to clean your cabin filter regularly on the dirt roads because you can't stop the dust from getting to there except by putting it on and recirculate because then it doesn't bring any air in. You thought you were doing the right thing, but... No, you're doing the wrong thing because by bringing the air on recirculate, it doesn't go out these one way. It's just down there, the whole assembly, right? It do, The air doesn't go out that way. So those flaps just sit there. They're meant to be like a bit of a one way valve top setup, I'll call it for you know want of a better words. But um, when there's no cabin pressure, so it just sits there, it's meant to be closed. But what actually really happens is all the dust billowing off that back wheel there and the front and all the three under the vehicle, where does it go? goes in up underneath here doesn't it you know it gets in under there under your off the whole car it all scoops in under the rear bar and it comes straight in backwards in all those vents is one of the worst places it comes in and it will just fill all these trims with dust and your whole car will get dust and especially at the back you know how these 150s they pile up with dust up the top of the door um anyway so long story short keep it on fresh if you like that info subscribe turn the bell on the recirculate button that's for when you've got a stinky Nissan diesel in front of you on the road, you know, blow, you know, that has had a tune. Bop, 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 GK Patrol, bop, bop, bop. Or some dude in a Hilux even or whatever, you know, and they're just blowing all those, billowing out that black smoke. And those 70-odd series V8 owners, they're just loving it right now, watching this video going, yeah, that's me. The more soot, soot gets the moot or whatever they reckon, right? So anyway, catch you in the next video, everyone. Recirculate button for the stinky cars in front of you in the city areas because that pollution and garbage will kill you get out in the country get some fresh air put it on fresh when you get around the busy areas put it on recirculate catch you on the next video